You're wrong about Dr. Doom. He, too, is a freedom fighter, just as you are. In those days, Laverie was ruled by a different tyrant, the Baron. Why? Why must we always run, Father? We can fight them. Always ready to fight, no matter the odds. Just like your poor mother. She would be alive today if not for... his father the next morning, nearly frozen to death. <laughs> they have murdered my mother, and now they have killed my father. They will pay. All of mankind shall pay for this. Even then, I had the uneasy feeling it wasn't young Victor Von Doom would need my protection. The gypsy's medicine cured my headache, but my hair, my hair! Gypsy, he sold me dust, not gold. Get him! Victor Van Doom, you are accused of... <laughs> Fool! Did you really think Victor Von Doom could be captured so easily? Uh, it's a life-size doll. A, a robot. And so the legend of the strange young gypsy grew until... Victor, a stranger to see you. Hello, I'm Dean Stockton of Eastern State University in America, and I'm prepared to offer you a full science scholarship. Victor used the college used its modern scientific equipment to conduct strange, forbidden experiments. Hey, Vic, I've been going over some of your notes, and I'm afraid you're a couple of decimal points off on some of your figures. Out! I have no time for you. Okay, find out for yourself. At last. His experiments ended abruptly. <laughs> What have I done to myself? My face, it is hideous. And so, Victor Von Doom hid from the world, taking refuge with the mysterious order of monks. Here he became Dr. Doom. <laughs> <laughs> 